So we have switched parks and are now going to Animal Kingdom. So I was gonna do front drive-in shot, but right before I pulled up to Animal Kingdom, there was a truck that was like zooming in and out between myself and two other Disney buses. And it was like terrifying. And then as I was pulling up, a car in front of me literally came to a stop instead of slowing down. And so I was like, I need to focus on where I'm going because people obviously don't know what's going on um, or just driving dangerously. So if you didn't watch my past vlog, we are coming from Magic Kingdom. We're park hopping. Um, I literally just changed my, sh my shirt and my ears. Um, still sparkly, um, still sweaty. Probably have sunburn. We're gonna have to take a soothing bath later. Apply aloe vera everywhere. But uh, yeah, we're gonna hang out at Animal Kingdom for a couple hours. Probably will be the last park I get to hang out in for a while. And call it a day. And there's so many people leaving. So I'm hoping that because it's the middle of the day and it's park copping hours, that people will be leaving Animal Kingdom either for the day because they've been here all morning or they'll be going to another park. So I can come in here and enjoy what very few attractions and things there are to do here. So I think we came here last September before we got the kittens, after Kiki died. Um, and we were not here very long because we came here to eat at Tiffin's because we had a discount. And then it started to rain, um, like downpour. And so we ended up leaving. Um, before that, I came here with uh, my friend Stephanie, which was like the year before but I might have been here on like a random trip with my in-laws. I can't personally remember, but other than that, like I think I've been to Animal Kingdom maybe once or twice a year within the last couple of years. So here we are. The lines aren't that bad though, I will say. Guests that do not comply will be asked to leave. 
Please abide by the two markings. Maintain this. How many? One. One? Come Thank on, take the part here. Alright, how many? Three. Three? Perfect. You guys need to take the middle right down the room behind you, please. Just stand as close as down as you can, please. Come on, buddy. Four. Four. There's this powerful animal called an Ikron, or as we call it, a Banshee. The way you're going to do this is by being matched to something called an Avatar. They're created by blending human DNA and Navi DNA. Once we match you to an Avatar, thanks to a special link chair, your mind will be able to control that avatar. And then get onto the link chair the way we showed you in the video. Then put on your flight visors. For your safety, throughout this entire experience, remain seated. Lean forward, hold it on. So I've only been on Flight of Passage. This is the third time I've ever been on. No, wait. Fourth time. <laughs> Fourth time I've ever been on Flight of Passage. And. It said it was a 60 minute wait. It looked more like a 40 and the line moved real fast. Um, I ended up sticking AirPods in and editing my video from this morning. <laughs> and but like, man, that ride is freaking awesome. I think next to Millennium Falcon, that is my favorite ride. Like overall, it is just phenomenal. So well done. I do love Millennium Falcon though. Still haven't ridden Rise yet, but that might be my next favorite. It's really kind of sad though. I feel like Pandora is wasted on Disney guests. Um, like I loved the movie Avatar and so I was excited about this, but I feel like it just came too late. You know what I mean? Um, I can't wait to eat at the quick food service here, but I always end up eating here and I'm not really hungry right now. So we'll just try and eat elsewhere because I know Animal Kingdom has great food everywhere. My last vlog, I talked about how Magic Kingdom's kind of iffy on foods. Animal Kingdom's got good food. So I'm gonna try and see Festival of the Lion King today. Um, it's one of my favorite um, park shows. Um, and I've missed that a lot as well. Um, so we're gonna see about getting a return time or how that works. They have shows for the next, oh, I just realized they only have like one more show. Mm, I may not be able to do that because they have them every hour and it's almost four and then the last one's at five. As expected, four o'clock one's full, it starts in five minutes. Um, and then, unfortunately, the last show is full. Or not full. It's People are lining up for it. But I'm not going to sit and wait an hour. We're going to go walk over to safaris. And then maybe do Everest. And see what happens from there. Aww. Yes? Can I help you, sir? the shortest line I've ever seen. There's only like three families. Okay, I found the rest of them. <laughs> it was like more like a 10 minute wait. Get the whole road to myself. Oh, yes, no, don't worry. Take your time. 
just admiring her beauty. You know, those horns may look large and heavy, but believe it or not, they're actually quite light. Nice. Through it, it helps cool them down. Well, on my left hand side, we're gonna see these little guys. They are springbok, and they live up to their name incredibly oh. well. Or a giraffe crossing the road in front of you as well. <laughs> Now they are incredibly curious animals. So if I stop a little too close, they will happily join us. So I'm gonna have to keep moving as we truck on along. Now a group of them is called a tower. This slowly but surely we are moving along. Are you gonna no, no, maybe not. No, just enjoying the road. Nice little walk. Let's see if uh they can perhaps scooch a little more. Of course, you notice those long, long necks. Like I said, they're very curious, and so they will happily stick their necks in our safari. <laughs> now, just one second, I do have to make a call in to the warden. And I see a giraffe in the road. <laughs> it's clearly stopped now. Watching everything happen are a beautiful cheetah. Where? <gasps> There's my mocha. Oh, there's so many of them. There's like three over there. Cheetah are incredibly unique. They have these beautiful, sweet, nutritious milk. It's gonna sell for quite the pretty penny down at the market. Cute. What a photo. Now, one of my personal favorite things about them is they have this unique ability to scream, just like a human. That was fun. But now we need to find water because I am so dehydrated. <laughs> too old for that ride. Oh, that was so much fun. I hate the going backwards part. That initial scream is not a scream of joy. <laughs> oh my god, that was so much fun. All right, we're gonna go towards Dinosaur. I feel like everyone left as soon as I got in line because Flight of Passage was not an hour, which is how long it said it was. I did the math. It could not have been more than 30 minutes and I haven't waited more than like 15 minutes for anything else that I've done. And the wait times are not very long, so. Good park day, glad that I did this. So this is good for me to know my own product knowledge at the resort. So they are allowing trading in the parks now in specific trading stations. I'm gonna show you the sign and the rules in just a moment. Um, but just let all you pin traders know they are doing pin trading. I'm gonna show you how.
totally got lost <laughs> as to where Dinosaur was. I could have kept walking instead of going through the Dinosaur Circus. Um, but I had to actually look at a map. I was like, where is Dinosaur? Did I displace it? I also think it's funny they've pinned up some of the dinosaurs. Found it! All of the babies are done. They're done. They're all like, I'm tired. I'm hungry. I've been here all day. It's time to go home. <laughs> to those who love dinosaur. I love dinosaurs. I love the Jurassic Park ride and I'll admit the Jurassic Park ride is kind of, this is so much worse. It's just like we're turning the lights off and you're gonna swerve to the left, to the right, to the left, to the right and not know where the heck you're going for no reason whatsoever. It's kind of, eh. I wish I could just redo it. But Alrighty, we have done, we saw, we conquered, we did a lot more than I anticipated. I've got the munchies, so I'm going to grind a Starbucks real quick, grab myself something cold and frozen for my way out. Thank you guys so much for watching. Stay safe, wear a mask where I'm needed. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I don't know when my next Disney Park video will be because I'm blocked out until who knows when. Um, but getting my second vaccination tomorrow, so that'll make life a little bit easier. So anyway, bye guys.